I woke up in such a good mood today because it's sunny out. The weather in New York has been so sad and gloomy, so I am in a really, really good mood right now. And I'm gonna take Dobby up for a walk, and then we're gonna get started on with our day. I just pulled out my spring and summer clothes and I just wanted to dress in something a little bit more summery. I really recommend getting dressed for yourself once or twice a week. It really boosts your mood. Today I'm gonna to be filming a what I eat in a day. It's been a while since I did one. I've been craving some of my favorite dishes so I'm gonna to try to make them at home. For breakfast, I always like to keep it very simple. I like to eat something quick and easy and get my day started. So I get more experimental with food later on throughout the day. Okay. So for breakfast, I always go for sourdough bread with avocados if it's ripe and a side of eggs. And that is breakfast. Mm. It's so good, but you can't have any of this. This is the reason why I need to get a dining table. Cause of you. <laughs> So after breakfast, I get hungry really fast, so I usually like to snack on stuff. So I'm gonna eat some mango green yogurt and Swiss roll cake green tea. This looks so good. Okay, for lunch today, I'm gonna be making vermicelli noodles. Before this quarantine thing, I used to eat a bowl of pho or vermicelli at least once a week. It is my go-to comfort food when I'm feeling a little hungover or sick. I resort to a bowl of noodles. Cutting board. I'm gonna wash my hands. Okay, so I'm gonna start off by marinating my chicken thigh. This is my protein of choice for today. Garlic, some lime juice, fish sauce, and some soy sauce, sugar, olive oil. The vegetables that I will be using today, romaine lettuce, cucumber, cilantro, I think this is jalapeno. I actually don't know what these things are called. <laughs> Some pickled daikon and carrots. You can make this on your own. Luckily, I was able to find pre-made ones at the grocery store. vermicelli noodles. You only cook it for like two minutes. I'm gonna strain the vermicelli. So for the sauce, you'll be needing garlic, a little bit of pepper, rice vinegar, and 
sugar as well. Water. And some fish sauce. It's everything else is really easy now. And goes the vermicelli noodle, some lettuce. Carrots and daikon, chicken, drizzle the sauce on. That is pretty fire. I look forward to Fridays and Saturdays because my favorite drama airs on Fridays and Saturdays. So I was on this drama streak with Crash Landing on You, Itaewon class, and then after that, I didn't like anything. And then I recently came across this drama called The World of the Married. It's not on Netflix, you just have to like Google it. I think it's on dramacool.com. That drama is so intense. If you guys are bored and you want to binge watch a drama, I recommend The World of the Married. I'm going to put that on my computer monitor and watch it while I eat. It's dinner time and today I'm going to be making something that I've never made at home but I've been having the biggest craving for hand rolls. I love Kazunori, their hand rolls are so good. So I'm going to attempt to make some hand rolls. So for my hand roll today, I'm going to be using these ingredients. This is sushi eggs. I don't know what this is called. Are these crab eggs? Salmon, radish sprouts, and cucumbers. So I have my rice here. I'm gonna put a little bit of vinegar in it and kind of fan it so it cools down. So my mom, she used to work at a sushi restaurant. So I had to ask her how to make the rice. Um, she said like, don't like stir it around too much. Like don't ruin the rice, which I feel like I already did but that's okay. Um, but she says you have to cool the rice. So here we go. No, that's not it. <laughs> First one is a giant fail, but I'm still gonna eat it anyways. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. No. Kind of has that shape. I'm sorry, this looks really messy. Dip it in my soy sauce. Mmm. -mm. I am so full right now, but I do have space for dessert. Mochi ice cream in the mango flavor. It's crazy how it's still so bright outside. <gasps> Although I feel like matcha will always be my number one favorite. This is really good. It's like nice and fruity. I love anything mango. We're gonna go in for a second one. That's pretty much everything I ate today. If you guys ever decide to create one of the dishes that I made, please tag me because I actually really enjoy looking at all of your recreations. Thank you guys again for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Fly with y'all, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, I said the beach, y'all. Uh. Wait.